Hi, it's Chris Crocker in the 4 News Now First Alert Weather Center. It's been an interesting day in the newsroom. We had a pretty good fire, a uh, hundred acre plus uh, burning down around the Spangle area, actually just north and east of Spangle. And it is windy this evening. We are experiencing wind gusts in the 25 mile per hour range. Uh, here's a look at the sustained winds around the region. Around Spokane, 17 mile per hour sustained winds, but wind gusts are closer to 25 miles per hour. Um, now you'll notice uh, further to the south, the same fire that was bringing the uh, smoke into the Spokane and Coeur d'Alene area yesterday is now keeping the smoke mainly, well the winds are actually keeping the smoke mainly down into the LC Valley and Grangeville and that is of course uh, the Evans Canyon uh, fire there near Yakima and uh, so wildfire smoke. I thought we might make it uh, through the season without any major problems. There's fingers crossed that firefighters will be able to get a hold of these fires uh, as our winds are going to be dying down. Winds will be dying down, but it is going to remain hot and dry. This is our weather pattern through the beginning of the weekend. Very dry, temperatures well above average, more than 10 degrees above, above average, actually uh, closer to 15 degrees above average by the time we're into Friday. Uh, and that ridge is not going anywhere. I do not see a drop of rain coming in the forecast. After we really heat up Friday and Saturday, we are going to gradually cool a little bit, but not quite back down to average. That white line is our average high. And as you can see, we are well above over the next uh, four to five days, a little bit closer to average Tuesday, but then may begin warming back up again. And boy, all the long range computer models I have seen are pointing toward hotter weather, hotter than average weather through most of September, if not all. Overnight lows tonight, kind of nice, that nice long night allows the temperatures to drop a little bit, 40s and 50s, and then we're up into the 80s and 90s. Man, tomorrow, 90s for Colville, Omac, Moses Lake, Lewiston, uh, close to 90 in Spokane Valley. It, there are a couple of days that firefighters may have their eyes on. Saturday, a breezy afternoon. Monday, Labor Day, could be quite windy. Um, some cooler air pushing its way in, so we'll be keeping an eye on those days. And then look at all those sunshines lined up in a row. My goodness, um, these are not very exciting times to be a meteorologist. You would think I've got plenty to keep me busy, including Wildlife Wednesday. It is Wildlife Wednesday, and that is where I feature tons of photos from the week from around the inland northwest of the various critters that uh, with which we with whom we share uh, our region that is tonight on four news now night side at 11 o'clock but also if you go to my facebook page i have i'm not exaggerating thousands of pictures of local wildlife uh, some by some of the best professional photographers in the region some just someone gets lucky with their cell phone camera, a little bit of everything. I hope you enjoy. Uh, in the meantime, thanks so much for watching.